Hello again. That assuming you've seen my two previous videos that I've uploaded this morning. It is June 22nd, 2012, 6.42 a.m. This is kind of creepy, huh? Okay. I don't know what that was. I'm just really tired. I'm a little hyper. I'm a little wired. But I decided to make a video talking about documentingreality.com. I'm not doing this to promote the website. I'm not doing this because I'm going to earn any money doing it, seeing that I'm just simply a member that doesn't have really any um, seniority there. It's a hard word for me to say. Documentingreality.com is a very well known um, gore site. And if you're not familiar with what gore is, it's death. Real life death. I'm talking about everything from shootings to murder to the very well known gore to a lot of people that don't watch this stuff. Beheadings. Where somebody gets their head cut off while they're still alive with a dull knife. Um, maybe it's kind of weird to people to know that I'm a f <laughs> that I'm not only a member but I'm a huge fan of this site documentingreality.com is not for everybody not at all this is a very serious um, video that I'm making because I'm warning you that if you are interested in documenting reality you really need to know what you're getting into it's uh, some serious shit um, there's actual like I said there's actual death there and uh, you know you've probably heard not to promote this either but you know it's the way it is you've probably heard of the video called one lunatic one ice pick and it's on that website it's on that website that I saw it before the police even caught the guy Luca Minota it's very real and uh, you know I've seen people on here you know there's uh, another guy on here that makes videos about documenting reality and I guess he's an actual member and all that which is cool but a lot of people have been asking him please invite me to the website please invite me to the website you know etc etc um, you know, hey, if you, if you can handle gore, you can handle death, you can handle all that kind of, uh, you know, reality, then, hey, you know what, come on down, you know, and uh, join the site. It's like 10 bucks for a life membership. And uh, if you're into that thing, it's well worth it. But I, like I said, I will warn you, it's, it's fucking real, you know. It, it's really death. It's really murder. It's really suicide on video. And uh, there's everything from grown people being killed even children that are you know victims on that website that they show because it is reality it's documenting the reality that doesn't make me sick <laughs> that doesn't make anybody including the site owner sick in fact we're just people that want to see the true and dark side of of humanity and reality and uh... me myself um... documenting reality is the most real thing you can legally, um, I guess I would say, legally uh, participate in. It's a forum, and it's a really cool forum. You know, it's actually a lot laid back than you would think with the kind of material that it uh, showcases. Uh, there's really, really cool people on there. To name a couple, there's uh, Kelly. She's uh, got the most posts on there. She's really cool. She's I've never had a problem with her personally, and uh, she seems to get along with everybody. The site owner, Chris Wilson, he's a really cool guy. And uh, pretty much everybody on there is. I've only had an argument with maybe one or two people. One that I remember. I don't even know if I've had an argument with anyone else. Um, but, yeah, like I said, you know, if you are one of those people that have come by this video because you're searching for anything related to documentingreality.com you've come to the right video because I'm telling you what it is it is serious 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 stuff and I just hope that if you decide to join there you don't do it with the impression that this is light stuff I mean this is different levels of gore but you never know what you're gonna get you know you could enter into a, a, a post okay a thread for example you can enter a thread that says man shot to death and you're like oh how brutal could that be you know there's probably not much blood blah 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 you go in there hit play and boom the guy's being shot to death which is exactly what the video thread said it was and then there's blood everywhere and a lot of people can't handle blood my mom can't handle blood my mom gets woozy at the sight of a lot of blood 
and uh, it, it's crazy. The one lunatic, one ice pick video of Luca Minota killing and dismembering and having sex with the dead body. That's, uh, that's one of the worst videos on there. Um, the maniacs, I cannot pronounce it, but where they kill that homeless man in the woods, that one's on there. That one was probably the worst. But the one plus about the site is they don't allow animal cruelty. In my opinion, animal cruelty is the hardest thing to watch. But a lot of people can't ever even imagine um, can't even imagine seeing a child be harmed. Well, for, you know, I, you know. But the good thing about that is the community is very strict about that. You know, there's a very big limit to what kind of um, children violence that there can be, and. Uh, there's no nudity allowed, of course. It's against the law, nor nor does any normal person want to see that. And uh, there's always a warning in the uh, uh, video thread description. So it'll be like, you know, child warning, baby warning. And usually it's just like abortions or abandoned babies left in the garbage dump, that kind of awful stuff. But uh, I just thought I would share this dark side with you guys that... Uh, you know I go to and it, you know I'm not I'm not demented I'm not sick I don't have thoughts of of uh, killing people or anything like that I could never harm I could even harm myself let alone other people you know but uh, it, it is reality and it, it, in the world we live in is scary it is when you go there it, it really shakes your world up I mean there's been people that have left documentingreality.com because they couldn't handle it anymore. They said, "I don't even feel, I don't even feel mo um, uh, I don't even feel anything when I watch somebody be murdered, and that's not good. I want to still feel, <laughs> so I have to leave." And they left. And me personally, I'll never be like that because I know what reality is. Even before I went to documenting, I had seen this kind of shit all over the web. So finding documenting reality for me as a gore fan of reality and, and wanting to see what is really out there, it was perfect. And that's why I've been a fan since 2009 and a member since 2009. So if you're looking to join documentingreality.com and you have more questions that maybe I didn't answer or answer thoroughly in this video, feel free to shoot me a private message or comment below and I will respond as soon as I see it. This is Z. Keith Carnes. Signing off. Bye, guys.